And that means that coming up next to the stage is J.W. Freeman. It's me, the Heartbreak Kid. I can't dance, I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, Fantastic. look at this. Fantastic. All right, so I'm opening this incantation. Oh. What do we got? We have uh, read how Katy Perry's video Firework is witchcraft and how the spell is cast. A magic spell of evil provided by spooks. Excellent. <laughs> we begin with a quote. <clears throat> I wanted to be like the Amy Grant of music, but it didn't work out, so I sold my soul to the devil, Katy Perry. Since Katy Perry sold her soul to the devil, she has become the biggest pop star this side of Lady Gaga. In 2010, her studio album Teenage Dream boasted five number one hits. She was MTV's 2011 Artist of the Year. Having gone double platinum and to number one, the song Firework came in as Billboard's number three song of the year for 2011 and won Video of the Year, the main and final award in the 2011 MTV Music Video Awards. It is shot by the Danube River at the former royal family's medieval Buda Castle Palace Complex Courtyard in Budapest, Hungary. The video may seem sweet and empowering on the surface, as an inspiring anthem for discouraged people to overcome their self-esteem challenges and shine, but I feel there is a very deep occult meaning. Ask yourself if someone who has sold their soul to the devil would make such a positive video. To me, the video is a play on what happens to our souls at death if we go into the light. I have a 1080p high definition copy of the video, so I suggest you find the best quality available. The video begins with the very soft sound of a siren as the camera pans across Chain Bridge and then across the sun wheel of a tower, which is too dark to be seen clearly, on which Katie is standing over a balcony. She's singing about feeling dead or being six feet deep. There is a Masonic checkerboard pattern beneath her feet. I had to do a lot of research on Google satellite maps to identify building tops, so I know exactly where she is standing. It is not at the palace. Once I found the building, Google identified it as Hell Energy, which makes an energy drink called Hell Energy Drink, whose motto is, gives you power like hell. By the way, this is in the text. You can't make this stuff up. Why, of all the possible site choices to shoot the video, did the director decide to use a place called Hell Energy? She sings, you got to ignite the light and own the night. Her heart starts bursting on fire and shooting sparks across the sky like fireworks on the 4th of July. She says to go boom, boom, boom and be brighter than the moon, moon, moon. Fuck it. <laughs> Having seen her heart at night, countless others start copying her behavior and they let their hearts ignite too. This may be forms of what is called imitative magic and sympathetic magic. As they sing moon, they show the dome of the castle. So, since most people have short attention spans, I'll get right to the core of the ritual to show how Katy Perry and her producers are using witchcraft in her video firework, and then I'll go into much more detail to show supportive evidence. Witches are known to practice magic by gathering in circles and rotating the circle either clockwise or counterclockwise depending on the intent. When you see the dancers form in the lion's courtyard, they form an eight-spoke sun wheel which is based around the solstices and known to witches as the wheel of the year. Katie is spinning counterclockwise inside the circle like a whirling dervish. Then they form a sun swastika with its tips pointed to the left, which is negative. Then finally, I believe they form a labyrinth. Since on the right side, there's a small opening or entrance, just like you see in mazes or labyrinths. Plus, underneath their feet is a six-mile underground labyrinth. The energy is directed at you, the listener, because Katie is singing the song in the second person, commanding you to ignite using the power of suggestion. 
In fact, she sings the word you or your about 35 times because there's a spark in you. You just got to ignite the light because, baby, you're a firework. People will listen to these suggestions over and over as the song is in heavy rotation on radio stations. Word. Many people will sing along to the song and internalize the subconscious message. Countless others who watch the video will remember the images of people igniting perhaps with a positive association reinforcing it, but it is being bound with the symbolism of the sun imagery. She sings another verse and then repeats the chorus. One guy runs past her wearing a sweatshirt that says, Soho District on it. No, uh, Soho may be an entertainment district in London, but Soho is also the name for NASA's solar and heliospheric observatory, and their website is known for posting images of the sun. The macabre images in this video, when the hearts burst or ignite, are very similar to when the souls were taken up and renewed in the fiery ritual of carousel in the movie Logan's Run. <laughs> the participants of the ritual in the movie would all chant, renew, renew, as the ascending spirits would ignite into flames. Katie advises you to ignite your inner spark. Go boom, 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 and become a firework that shoots across the sky. The t-shirt of the middle hoodlum harassing one of the heroes of the video reads, Nyon. In Celtic astrology, which Wiccans and Druids hold in high esteem, Nyon was a mermaid or siren of the god Gwydion, a lunar deity symbolized by the ash tree whose symbol was the trident or seahorse or mermaid. Nyon is probably also where we get the word union. In effect, a band named The Union has a song called Siren Song. <laughs> if you pause the video at just the right time, you will see that the middle thug has vampire fangs. Also, the hoodlum to the right in the hood looks like the evil-looking Jedi warrior, Nyon, in the Star Wars movie series. Why did the director choose a musician who practices magic for a character? The video was released on Thursday, October the 28th, 2010 for the Halloween weekend, which is the Gaelic Harvest Festival, which is the biggest holiday for witches. The witches triangle of manifestation, which is the symbol Jay-Z, Rihanna, and all the rappers give, also Diamond Dallas Page, needs two points, space and time, in order to... It's me. All right, sorry. In order to maintain, the, so the video may use hell energy and a labyrinth for the space and Halloween, a.k.a. All Souls Day for the time. The theory of this website is that the video and song show that at death our souls are ripped apart, R.I.P., and are shot across the sky to be used as hell's energy in the sun, which is the wheel of rebirth. They are lured to the light moon, which is a siren, probably the alien being, beings Katie sings about in her video E.T. to whom she sings, lead me into the light. The energy is stored there and then most likely during a solar eclipse. Oh my God. <laughs> hey guys. All right. Hey, it worked. <laughs> solar eclipse set to the sun to be ignited as solar flares are directed back to earth. We are then renewed on Earth, which is a matrix, a maze, or prison. J.W. Freeman!